In an exclusive interview, the Prime Minister's top econo economic advisor, Dr. C. Rangarajan, has told NDTV the worst may be over for the rupee. The currency, he says, will stabilize and strengthen from here on. We've seen the rupee plunge 20% uh, or more this year, and that remains the critical worry for policymakers. Uh, when do we see the rupee actually stabilizing and at what levels? Well, at what level is something very difficult for uh, anybody to say. But I, I believe that uh, at the present level, uh, the rupee is well corrected. So if we take 2004-05 as a base, uh, the calculations made on what they call the real effective exchange rate clearly indicates that somewhere um, about 62 to uh, or 63 rupees to the dollar, it is well corrected uh, and uh, uh, therefore anything beyond that is the result of uh, various other uh, forces that are operating in the, in the, in the system. Uh, therefore, um, I believe that uh, the uh, rupee can stabilize. Um, and in fact, even strengthen from the current position as right. capital flows uh, uh, come in. Um, therefore, uh, uh, we are on the road to stabilization. So you believe the worst may be over for the rupee? I think so. In terms of uh, the, the kind of uh, depreciation that we've seen over the last few weeks? You see, in some sense, the, um, uh, the, the value of the rupee uh, in, the, in the foreign exchange markets is being determined not only by our own actions, right. but also what is happening in the rest of the world right. uh, over which we have no control. Uh, if the Syrian crisis um, takes on a more serious turn, sure. uh, I do not know what impact it, it will have, apart from the increase in the oil prices, but also even in the uh, uh, capital flows coming in can be affected. Uh, but barring uh, something uh, very untoward happening, uh, I see the stabilization coming in. And, and at these levels of say 65, 66 is what you think would be a... Well, I, I'm not saying which is the appropriate. I'm right. saying that it, is, it can stabilize around uh, the, uh, the current level. And if capital flows come in, it can further strengthen, the rupee can strengthen.